what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of fps dropping stuttering or frame dropping issue you're currently having in roblox so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial and in the end you will probably know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue before we start right into the video i just want you guys to know let you guys know that, that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys you would support my work here on youtube a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so the first step is gonna be to navigate to the bottom of your screen right clicking it and opening up your task manager Next step is going to be to navigate to the top left corner of the screen, clicking onto processes just to ensure that you're sticking around it. Afterwards, click onto CPU and end every single task which is currently having too much CPU usage and obviously has nothing to do with Windows by just simply right clicking it and clicking onto end task. And I obviously, want you to do the same thing for your GPU. So, let me explain that. Too many applications, background processes, whatever running at the same time on a low end or bad pc with too much cpu gpu usage will cause lagging fps drops stuttering whatever and you're just avoiding this issue by just simply ending those tasks so once you're finished you should be able to enter task manager again and the next step is going to be to navigate to the bottom left corner of, the of your screen clicking onto the windows symbol and opening up your settings next step is going to be to click onto gaming and stick around the xbox game bar where i want you to obviously turn the xbox game bar off because the xbox gamer doesn't really come with any benefit besides impacting your performance really bad and uh just causing stuttering so turn this just turn this off next step is going to be to click into captures and what i want you to do as capture is going to be to go to background recording and go to record in the background while i'm playing a game and obviously turn this off because if this is turned on without you knowing that this will impact your performance really bad you don't want that and you simply turn this off Next step is going to be to uh, click into game mode. And what I want you to do is going to be to either turn it off or on. I can't really tell you now to turn this off or on. You just need to check it for your system specifically and just stick with the setting which is working better. Go back once and click into update and security as the next step and stick around Windows Update. And I know guys, it's going to sound a little bit basic, but trust me, updating every single driver you could possibly update will help you a lot with every kind of issue you're currently having on your PC and also with FPS drops, stutterings and frame drops. So just download the latest version of Windows by just simply clicking on to check for updates. Once you're finished, just simply end this task and do the same thing for your graphics storage. So go to M you just go to your application, go to the browser and download the latest driver of that just to provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. That's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one, guys. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment or a subscription. And I guess I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just trying to do my best in order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one and bye.